and we return yet again to some more Europa Universalis 4 with the Art of War DLC installed and with the mod Veritas at Fortitudo 2.0.0. No, 2.0.0. Okay, um, so last time we completely conquered you know, England. You know, this, this piece here, not really sure how to call it because you've got so many bloody names, the same thing as Holland or the Netherlands. However, the Dutch don't care. They don't care. Whereas the English might get upset because, well, there is still, uh, you know, a northern part of Ireland uh, that's part of England and Ireland that's part of Ireland and, you know. Yeah, whereas in uh, the Dutch case, it's, yeah, you've got two provinces. One is called North Holland and the other one is called South Holland. However, that's not the complete Netherlands, so whatever. <laughs> So uh, for this one, I was kind of thinking, well, we want to strike, um, well, not only at the Irish, because, well, we just did. We took Derby and uh, we kind of had to fight the whole of Ireland in order to get uh, Scotland be gone. So we're still uh, waiting on a, yeah, um, this here. However, we are, I don't really think, too, too powerful just yet to combat uh, France. However, I might be wrong. I mean, if I were to uh, press a claim here, I don't really have anything. But who would join me? Um, okay, Burgundy, Aragon, Portugal. Why not you, Flanders? At the toward enemies. Really? You're a neighbor. Oh, well, don't really care. Um, and who do you have? You've got, um, yeah, all your buddies. So, on the one hand, I might be strong enough. On the other hand, I might not really be strong enough. And uh, only time will tell. So uh, that's why we will uh, invest our nicely earned monies in, um, yeah, <laughs> ships. <laughs> because honestly, what would you else do? I mean, you're England. You've got all this beautiful coastline space. <coughs> we will use it properly. Uh, and that means, let's see, show me the ships. Okay. How many am I building and what is my force limit? I am building 15. That's a little, little bit too much because we can only build 13. So there we go. 13, that means we've got some money for an additional infantry unit. That's good. Okay, and luckily we don't really have to uh, core anything because uh, it, you know Scotland already was part of our uh, we already had it called uh not, not really sure what it's called but you know you do get the message across so we don't have to do it uh for a reason okay that's uh that's all I'll, i will tell let's see um we'll just take our nicely nice trading ships and we'll just check how many things can we get into so these three I've got 18, so that means six per finger barber. Let's see, six here. Go. Managing these things are sometimes a pain in the ass. However, they did add the. Uh, where is it? Mothball. Hmm. Mothballing can only be used on ships that are currently in port. Uh, it will make the fleet useless as long as, as mothballing is enabled. A mothballing fleet will act if the maintenance slider is at zero. It will have no strength, will not repair or move, and will cost less each month. Ah, that's interesting. So it's basically if you have a attack fleet you only use during wars, you could, yeah, mothball it. So reducing its maintenance cost. Interesting, like, me like. Okay, Um, where's the bloody feature? Um, because, well, I'm looking for the feature that is called, um, yeah, return uh, when at war. Uh, okay, however, let's see. You split. There we are. Let's see. Detach. Detach from gate. Okay. Start patrolling. Or is it like a feature I just imagine? I don't know. Um, you are Sussex. So that's London North Sea. You will go to the North Atlantic. Okay, and then next build 
fleet will uh, do. So, for instance, these guys will be moth bottle. And, uh, sure, moth bottling. Oh, wow, they actually get a little, little anchor. Okay, that's nice. Um, okay, so we now have 16 stack. We might just wreck a little bit. Or we just wait for France to go to war with anyone again, and then that will be our, our sign to intervene yet again. <clears throat> okay, um... Okay, here we are. Let's form up this little navy of, I believe, 13 guys, okay. <laughs> the other three or so we just made. Um, <clears throat> okay, military leader has died, it is unfortunate. However, we will now uh, roll the dice again and get... Mm, yeah. It's not an improvement, honestly. Uh, yes, okay, good. Split you guys in half. And go for Paris. And you will go to... Uh, Lisbon. Sure, why not? <coughs> Okay, that's uh, it for now. Let's see. Truce with Norway. I kind of want you. Declare war. I don't really have anything. And the truce will expire when exactly? 1331? However, okay, August. Okay. Mm, that's uh, long enough for me to get a claim on you. Fabricate claim. Orkney. Here we go. Move you guys already to the promised land. Good. Hmm. One question though. Will the automatic transport still work? Um, okay, it will. Excellent. So not only mothballing, but just... Wow. They uh, they really, really thought it out this time, I must say. Um, hmm. Question though. Could I? No, I cannot claim anything else outside this, eh? Mm, because I kind of want this here too. I want uh, to... Hmm, okay. Because I usually use Orkney as a justification to get something else. So we might highlight Rebellion, honestly. Uh, you know you know what to do, you know, just kick it. Okay, Um. so we might just... Uh, Get our navy at ready. Okay, because of this morph balling, it will not do anything. That, that's okay. That's good, I guess. Um, sure. So we killed the Highland Rebellion. Lost not that many men. Killed them all. Not a Highland Rebellion. Wow, surprise, surprise. Yet again. Uh, yes, good. So we're not really too, too effective killing machines because we only kill... Yeah, not too many. That's actually a nice thing. Good. Okay, you are supposed to be repaired. Oh, wow. Moth Balling is basically neg neglecting the motherfuckers. Really? Okay, uh, benign neglect. Okay. Um, it seems that uh, the government that governs the least govern... Wait, what? It seems that the government that governs the least governs the best as far as is concerned. It seems that the government that governs the least governs. Okay. Our non involvement in, uh, in has proven beneficial as the local economy is booming. Okay, they can do things on their own. So, local trade power, local tax modifier. Hmm. Manpower is not an issue in this, uh, in this mod. I mean, otherwise, it would be like damn manpower. But uh, let's see, what is our most income for now? Taxation, so damn, taxation it is. Increase that sucker, sure, why not? But yeah, mothballing is basically ignore it. That's, that's good that we find that out um, before we lose the whole shebang. And we got like one more ship. Um, I don't really have any form for you, so because, well, 6666, six, 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 that does have a, a ring to it. Okay, uh, still waiting half a year for our war to kick off. 
And uh, yeah, <coughs> we'll make it a war about, uh, well, mm, I definitely want Iceland. It's one of those things that you really, 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 really want. However, I'm not really sure if I want to do it right now though, because supply limit is low and um, I'm not really sure if I could core it is the problem. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's not, it's not for the money. <laughs> Not at all. It is. Uh, it is about the colonial game because you've got two, two, two means of entering. You know, these little islands here. So the Canar, uh, really, the Canaries, or you know, Norway, Iceland. I mean, not Norway, but Iceland. So yeah, that uh, that, that that should that should uh, work in some way. <laughs> Okay, let's see. Um, how are our relations going? Okay, we've got six out of six. We have a happy relationship view, somewhat happy because we're not really doing anything, so we might as well improve some relations. Mm -hmm. Okay, improve yours as well. You never know when uh, you need to uh, really uh, drag a country over the line of war. So, uh, yeah, you know, 99 could be a neutral country and 101 could be, yeah, the most uh, arms to the teeth country ever. Okay. Really? Two? Okay. Well, this, this will just happen for the next uh, 30, 20 years or so. Still, or, or a little bit more, 30 years. I don't know. Uh, yearly, mm, oh, that's a good one, trade range, hmm, sure, make it happen, good. But these bosses are really, <laughs> wow, they are really getting the claims on us. It's not like they can, you know, push the claim or whatever you want to call it. But yeah, they're doing it regardless. They don't give a fuck. Uh, that's, that's interesting. We're not really, oh, so... Getting our legitimacy up. Uh, it's going up over time. Um, but it didn't want to go. Wants to come back. Uh, do we have a relationship with you? We have a state marriage with you. We will accept gladly. And there we are. Uh, Alliance causes Bella against Nexus. Why? I don't know. Okay. Uh, damn, France, you're very careful with all the things you're doing, unless you're trying to annex anyone. And the coalition against Aragon, interesting. Um, but sure, uh, perhaps you should just uh, play the little bitch and just warn him, <laughs> send an insult or warn them not to attack anyone. However, we do want you to attack someone. Mm hmm. Mm. Yeah, I mean, I kind of want the coast. I definitely want the coast. Just because those are, yeah, the most valuable this here one this one is very valuable because that's the straight routes are going straight through it i could imagine at least because well it's twice as valuable i suppose uh okay that's uh oh wow we actually passed the not the um should we just go in and just deal with it Sure, we'll, we'll go in and deal with it. Uh, tier O gain, that's a problem. Why are you allied to him? <sighs> well, we just have a truce with him. No, we don't. Okay, instead we'll just go to war with you and uh, yeah, we'll, we'll sit on Orkney a little while longer. Don't you worry, we will, uh, let's see. We would want from you, oh, we could take either. Let's first take you, because I tend to have a problem with taking capitals. So let's take the other one first, and then the other one comes slowly after. Okay, let's see. Norway will join. Um, well, we'll just leave a adequate force. There we go, that's adequate enough. And then we'll, we'll steamroll you. Well, perhaps we should leave, like... One more guy. I mean, three to one. That's those are my odds. 
usually. Uh, we also can crown you with a leader. Not the best one, but a. we better have a leader than no leader. And then a bloody revolt happens as well. You come back. Deal with it first. Well, it's morale is low. Okay. Interesting. Uh, either the vault is uh, just yeah not really having the steamed head it used to have. Or, well, that just happened. Um, mm -hmm. Okay. Let's see. Stability increase. Nice. That's nice. <laughs> Okay, um, the merchants are suffering. Our focus on merchantalism is making life hard for our merchants who trade in foreign places. Okay, give them support, or they should have stayed at home. Really? No. How are we focusing on merchantalism uh, whilst we are not focusing on merchantalism? Oh well, um, one or two. <laughs> Here we are. Let's see, let's uh, start making... Uh, Getting these guys rolled out even further. Of course, in the beginning, your economy is not really the strongest thing in the world. However, after a while, we, you, you'll get something uh, that is very strong. Okay, how far are we doing here? Getting there. We are getting there. Civil war. Tiro gain. Okay, we are fighting the right one. Okay, ignore you. Ignore, oh, wait. We can perhaps form something. Hmm. We can. Okay. Can we do something nice? Uh, the advancement of religions. Religion act. Have theology. And that will just be good. Okay. Well, we'll accept. And we've lost you. Don't really have the money to replace you just yet. However, uh, one of the two should suffice. Okay. Um. Anything else? Uh, well, we're just waiting for now. Uh, come on. Hit that 100%, bruh. Just go for it. Go for it. 100. There we go. And let's see. Do you have any friends we might want to... No, Norway and Fomond. Well, I don't really believe Fomond will join you. Oh, wait. they Fomond, you say? Fomond, Fomond, Fomond. Well, uh, Fomond might join. Mm, same old bloke. Diplomat's Ascent. Sure. Uh, not going to say do your worst. But, uh, yeah. We'll fight. If that's what you are after. Here we are. I'll just use you to uh, trap your ass. Okay, killed you. Nice. Uh, you will not. No, wait, there we go. That's the combination. Okay, how hard is this one then? Uh, well, not too, too hard, I, I hope. <laughs> okay, um, we are looking at a sizable force probably coming from the Norwegians. However, we've got a trading ships basically surrounding this, uh, this one. Okay, uh, you... Do both hate me, I guess? Yes, you do. Okay, killed you. Kill him as well. And killed you too. Good. Mm, and we are looking at... Oh, well, they do have galleys. Uh, something that might kill my, uh, my transport sh fleet. But yeah, I'm not really sure if they wish to engage. And we'll just... Uh, Take what we want and then we'll just leave, you know. It's not really going to be a problem, I hope. Just a quick one. The sooner we're done, the sooner we can start next time, you know. That's the way you should look at it. You've heard it first, you know. <laughs> okay. Nice. Oh wow, that happened. <laughs> nice. Uh, well, we didn't even take that, took that much that much damage though. That's wow. Uh, good to know. Good to know. Um, hmm. Okay. Seas of Orkney's over. Good to know as well. 
well that's that's basically the only thing I'll, I'll add to that you know it's good to know but uh, it's taking its time though uh, it's just well let's uh, help the siege a little bit at least okay you uh, split and go forth and uh, blockade this port as well And perhaps, uh, well, it is tempting to also demand that they uh, release, yeah, you know, they, <laughs> I mean, all the claims they're just making is ridiculous, just, just look at it, look, all this, this striped is claims they've got on my lands, it's, why, <laughs> you can't press the claims, dude, <laughs> not, not at all, okay, well, we'll end the war right here, we'll take our Okay, you don't want it. Why? The length of the war is too short. Mm -hmm. Well, okay, that is expected. However, we did fight. That, you know, there was that one battle. Remember? Okay, and... Oh, wow. They did not just... Uh, okay, that happened. And uh, even on the side of Flanders. Of all people. Huh. Um, what war? What is this war about? If defender against the Brabant in the Brabantian conquest of Loon. Loon. Well, well, well. Um. Excuse me. How? Loon. Um. Where's Loon? Loon. It is here. However, for some reason, you upset. Oh, you went to war with the French? Oh, you're fucked. <laughs> oh, well, it's defensive war. Should really be that big of a problem. I don't know. Or am I now just looking at it a little bit too, uh, yeah, salty? At least we can now see how many forces they've got. Uh, and we can now enter this war as well, because, well, we completely own your ass. All your money, and war repetitions. Oh, wow. Sure, you desire that as well. There we are. And one more province. It's good. Now we can take you two and just drop them off in the new province as well. And, uh, well, that's, uh, that's it for this episode. Uh, to you, I ask only to leave a comment. And just uh, express your feelings towards me, you know? Just what do you like or dislike about... Uh, well, money. Sure, I'll take the money. Uh, what do you like or dislike about the series? Uh, leave a comment. That way I can improve. That's the only way. I mean, just ignoring me is not going to help me. And, well, I will respond. <laughs> Simple as that. So, thanks for watching and uh, bye.